Welcome to this course on analyzing 3D space frame structures using the direct stiffness method in Python. After completing this course, you'll have the knowledge, skills, and tools to be able to build 3D models and analyze them using your own structural analysis codes in Python. This course will take your level of understanding and your level of self-reliance in structural analysis to another level. I'm Dr. Sean Carroll, I'm a Chartered Engineer, a Senior Lecturer in Structural Engineering and I'm the Head Tutor here at DegreeTutors.com. In this course we'll be using the Direct Stiffness Method, an elegant and scalable analysis technique. Now most undergraduate engineering programs that cover the Direct Stiffness Method stop with the analysis of relatively simple 2D structures and while the expansion to three dimensions from here is relatively straightforward, unfortunately many undergraduate students never cover this, which is a great shame because this is where the real power and scalability of this analysis technique really does come into its own. Now one of the reasons that we don't tend to tackle three-dimensional structures with the direct stiffness method in undergraduate programs, partially it's because of the hassle and headache of generating 3D models to work with. Now in this course we're going to tackle that head-on by using an open source modeling software called Blender. Blender is, as I said, an open source modeling tool that is exceptionally powerful and versatile. And with its Python API it's going to be a perfect fit for our modeling and analysis workflow. This combination of state-of-the-art 3D modeling software combined with our bespoke structural analysis codes is going to give you the ability to model and analyze large-scale 3D space frame structures that you wouldn't have considered modeling previously without the help of some heavyweight structural analysis software. This course uses Python effectively as a means of scaling the direct stiffness method. Now, like all degree tutors courses that use Python, you don't have to be proficient in Python to take this course. You don't have to be an expert in Python. You can happily take this course as a relative beginner. The way I usually summarize this is by saying that this isn't a learn Python course, but you're going to learn the Python you need as we progress through the course. And so I won't turn you into a Python developer, but you're going to learn what you need to get through the course and by the end of the course you'll have enough Python knowledge to deploy on your own projects. So who should take the course? Well, anybody who has taken our previous course on 2D truss analysis or our previous course on 2D beam and frame analysis using the direct stiffness method. In particular, if you've studied the direct stiffness method for 2D structures and you want to see it in full 3D and really see its power and flexibility, well, this will be a good course to enroll in. It's also a good course for anybody who wants to leverage programming in their structural analysis. So, if all of that sounds like something that you'd enjoy getting your teeth into, enroll in the course and I'll see you on the inside.